Oh my god, I'm getting tired of recording this over and over again. If you like these videos, like, sub, silly, comment, share, support the channel if you want. I also added memberships because people kept saying to turn memberships on. So what do you get from a membership? You get those FGCM Pikachu emojis, I guess. So if you want to support the channel, you can do so by that mean. Um, I saw some people complaining about stuff still, the haters, and I guess since I have to make a video, I'll try to blow your mind with some more stuff that is quotation marks new that the community probably never realized because they probably don't actually test the shit that I show. So people still complain like, oh, double orb is hard to space. It's so hard to space. Dude, dude, it is not that hard to double space a double orb. Are you always that close? It is pretty lenient. Wow. Double orb. Like, like, what are you talking about? Is this that hard to space? Wow, look, I'm at this perfect sweet spot. I can just keep doing this over and over again. Wow, I'm at the sweet spot. Blah, 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 blah. Wow. Wow. Right? Not that hard. Are you always up in the guy's junk like that? And even if you are up in the guy's junk... Wait a second. Oh, that whole setup does that. Wow, we're, we're right back at this spot. All that stuff works from like the, the overhead, you know, plus overhead, all that kind of stuff that I showed, right? Oh, wait a second, what about just right here? Oh, fuck. What, are, are you serious? Are you serious, it's not that hard to space? It's, it's pretty realistic? So, you might say, well, let's look at this. So if he does this right here, boom, boom, blah, 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 blah. But you might be like, well, Clayton, what if the guy stand blocks? The guy is thinner. Well, you know what? If you're a hater and you say stand blocking doesn't work, this shows you don't actually know how to play a video game or test it. So watch this. If we do that same thing, it missed. And you're like, oh, Clayton's been exposed. But wait a second. Watch this. Whoa, dude. Not only did it hit me when I actually, as a human being, try to block it standing because you walk backwards a little bit. Did you see the frame advantage? Normally, this is minus four. Right? But let's watch this again. If I duck block it, four. What if I try to stand block this shit? Two. Well, what do you know? What do you know? When you actually try to block this in a real match, it actually, if you try to stand block it, it puts Vegito at a bigger advantage because the orb hits slightly late. Do you know how to test a video game? This is crazy. Please do not listen to anyone in the Discord, any of these other content creators, people on Twitter that they think that they know how a video game works. Because they don't. I've told you guys this so many fucking times. The people that act like they're smart at video games are generally not. Okay? Anyway. So besides that, um, I saw, you know... People trying to hate, like, oh, you can just double reflect orb. You can't just double or double reflect all this stuff. The whole point is, do you know the, do you know the thing that I'm showing here that goes along with the bug? So if, if we look at this again, the whole reason the bug works is, um, what am I setting to? Um, guard cancel, right? Super dash, right? The way the bug works is you have six frames. Normally you can't homely dash or reflect through a fireball, right? Yeah, so watch me. I'm trying to medium. He's going to hit me. Sorry, excuse me. He's gonna hit me. But a bug happens, and you have six frames to do the bug. Obviously, you don't want to use those full six frames. You want to time it as a just frame, so... Or sorry, what am I doing? Hits at one frame, right? So now if I medium, it's gonna hit him. So he has one frame to get out of that. To either choose the homing dash or reflect. That means... He has to guess. He has to guess on a double reflect, right? So if we were to show this, and we're thinking about stagger pressure and all this kind of stuff. So say if I were to be like, oh, boom. So now if the opponent is actually playing, he has to guess to reflect, right? He has to guess, is he gonna reflect, is he not? Well, if he tries to reflect here, and what if I just throw? He's gonna grab it. Right? What, what if he staggers? So again, we'll do um, of the computer do it to me, I guess. Right? 
Oh, I didn't even get it. So that there, there, there it goes. It goes to show you it's a, a just frame, just technically a just frame. So you can miss it in the first place. But oh well, fuck! I got hit. Oh wow, wow! What a, what a coincidence! I have to commit. So if we're doing this, this is what I'm trying to tell you. Let's watch this again. If you don't know how this bug works, normally I'm at a plus four, but. Now he's at a plus four, which means unless I have a DP, unless I have a DP or an invincible move complete, you know, and a lot of moves in this game aren't even frame one invincible. If he does something, I'm gonna get hit, right? We were, I was like, oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna commit to a double reflect. Okay, you committed to a double reflect on a guess, right? But what if I'm just like, right, sorry. What if I'm just like, oh, whoa. See, I didn't get there, but. And then get there. I'm gonna show you. you gotta, I'm, I'm, I'm guessing because I can't even see it coming. Can, do you know what I mean? So it's like, wow. I, I could have said, obviously, kind of hard to tape myself with two people recording. But you get the idea, right? So you have to guess, right? And then if we were to look at this kind of stuff, I'm trying to think the exact. It's kind of hard to play this as one person. But so if I do, I'm trying to think. I'm guessing basically. <laughs> Oh, did you see that? Did you see I just got hit right there? So I'm mashing, I'm like, oh, Clay's not gonna do this. Oh, wait a second. I'm mashing, I'm trying to get out of this. But when you do this Vegito pressure, do you realize that all these setups that you're doing, you actually can't just mash? You actually start to have to time the reflex? Oh, I got hit. Oh, see, there I missed it, and then I'm stuck. I'm not going to be able to do anything. I even I missed mashing. That might just be me getting old. <laughs> but there I missed mashing again. Fuck me, dude. Mash. Get get the reversal, Clayton. Oh, sorry, my. Well, there I got hit again. That just goes to show you, just a little bit. So you know that that's actually good that I got hit there too, because that just goes to show just a small bit of smidge spacing made me miss the double reflect there on it. Can you imagine? Can you get the reversal, Clayton? <laughs> oh, I gotta remember. I'm trying to time it to show. Oh my goodness, Jesus Christ! Jesus Christ, can you get it? I should probably be trying to time it, but you know what? I... See, there you go. Do you know what I mean? So all this thing that all this pressure that you're doing with the judo, you actually have to start to time the reflex. And if you're mashing, you're guessing. Do you get what I'm getting? You're guessing. I did a bug. This is, it's it's so crazy that people that I actually have haters trying to say that, you know, time with this double orb stuff they don't understand. It's like, oh, well, I'm just always going to mash on a double reflect every time. Why the fuck would you do that? You, you're basically guessing. Is he going to do the bug or not right there? This is regular stagger pressure. So regular stagger pressure to even attempt to get out of this, you have to guess. Because you have to guess for that just frame, right? And then... You know, it's like, well, fuck. Maybe I only want to reflect the first hit, right? We have these kind of situations. Look, look right here. Because um, I'll show you a situation here where you might not want to. Like, look at this kind of situation. Um, where, what am I doing? Or super dash, right? He's just going to get hit anyway. So Z reflect, right? So we're at this mid-screen space. Oh, am I going to get in here? Whatever. Oh, I'm harassing with double orb, right? Oh, I don't want him to do a sassy kick to be plus, so I'm going to try to double reflect. Oh, well, fuck. There, whoa, whoa, dude. Whoa, dude. He mad because he thought he was going to do the double effect. So you know what? Oh, shit, what's he going to do? Well, fuck. Like, do you play video games? Do you know anything you're talking about? You can't just always double reflect because you will get hit. Maybe there's situations where you only just reflect like, well, fuck, I don't want to take the whole thing. The whole point is, and this is crazy, I don't know, it's not fucking rocket science. There's this sweet spot you can set up. Everything puts you back here that you do. And when you're at this position, you have this unga bunga, whatever kids say nowadays, normal, that you just spaz out. And it always sets you up for the, oh, he was standing and he got hit. <laughs> you know what I mean? So, you know, you have this unga bunga normal, and no matter what you do, you're always fucking safe. The Banshee Blast stuff, you, you know what I mean? It's like, oh, everything is fucking safe. 
And the guy has to try to guess to get out of it. And when they try to guess to get out of it, they're likely to get hit because you're always safe. While you're staggering pressure, that, that's the whole point I was trying to get at. The homing dash stuff, no matter what you're doing, you have an option that they get hit if they try to homing dash out of it, right? Again, we, we show the examples again. If they were to, like we'll set it to the reversal this time, right? We set it to the reversal, right? Oh, well, he did it anyway. Even if he gets the reversal, he gets hit. You're fucked. It doesn't matter, right? Oh, shit. It doesn't matter even if it... So, homing dash is, for the most part, null and void, right? For the most part. Because all your options are covered. They try to get out. So, that's what I was trying to get. Well, what happens if they reflect? Well, what does it matter? Keep reflecting me. All my normals keep pushing me back forward. I keep going forward. And that's why I said you have this one thing. Oh, we actually have the falling Banshee Blast shit. That's like a more realistic application of that because while he has to delay and try to real or differentiate his timings of reflect, we have falling Banshee Blast shit. Oh wow, he kept reflecting while wow, you just did a falling Banshee Blast stuff. Maybe he didn't reflect that time. Maybe he did. Well, no matter what, you did a falling Banshee Blast and you're right back in. Wow. Oh, maybe I just did all my normals that keep moving me forward. Doesn't matter. Oh, maybe, you know, he reflected. Now I did this. Wow, I'm plus. Because he's like, well, do I keep reflecting or do, do I only reflect once? If I only reflect once, guess what? Now I'm at the advantage and I have to hold this. Quotation marks hold this because I don't have any normal that is fast enough to beat this. And I don't even know if I have an invincible move to beat this. And then while you're staggering this pressure, it's like, well, fuck, I don't know if I want to double reflect now. Because if I try to double reflect, any slight delay automatically hits me. Because the because when you play, remember, the reflect has to reflect something before it becomes completely invincible throughout the duration. Simple. Support the channel. Not It's not fucking rocket science, guys.